Hey guys, it's Jake Scream here back with another video, and welcome back to Glitch Tale, Season 2, Episode 4, Love, Part 1. This is a two-part episode. I don't know how I'm going to work this. I may just record both parts maybe in one sitting and upload them at different times, or I'll just double upload. Um, but, um, well, yeah, I got, um, uh, we know if, uh, Mundane's about to fight Betty, so I got my water bottle here. Uh, some Southern Grove dry roasted peanuts. Not trying to advertise, promise. Um, yeah. Let's see what's gonna happen. Please watch the previous episodes before you watch this one. Mm hmm. Don't to check out the music, sound effects, and the voice acting. Okay. What the heck? Make the turbines and turn off the magnets. Impossible, Dr. Gaster. The core's temperature won't go down. Oh, is this flashback? You don't have to minimize the danger of the entire room to be affected. Gaster! This place is falling apart. Get out of there! The experiment failed. Now the core is overheating. If I don't stop it, it'll destroy everything. That sucks. Oh, it's too dangerous. Get out! Everyone evacuated! Gaster! Yeah. I don't know how you can do hand language like that, really. Oh, the crap. Won't explode. But this room is too unstable. We must leave immediately. Ah! That poor guy. Gaster! Gaster! Dang, I forgot about that last episode. <gasps> Gaster, stay still. You need to rest. <sighs> Get your hands off me. Don't be rude to her. She's the one who brought you here. <sighs> Where is Alfie's? I told her to retreat with Jessica. She said she had a plan to kill that child. And told me to bring you here. Yeah. We have to go back. You're in no condition to do anything. You'll just get hurt. Even more. Yeah. She will die if we don't help her. I know. <gasps> Crap. Gaston. <laughs> Dang, you got hit hard. Undyne went to help her. What? Yeah. She's gone um undying mode. Undyne's got all your power. Oh no. Mm-hmm. If Undyne is fighting her, you might have a chance. What do you mean? Us. Monsters. We are supposed to be able to bleed, for we don't possess that much physical matter. But now, since we've been living amongst humankind and eating their food, we've gained a bit more of a physical... Yeah, get used to it after a while, yeah. Making us able to withstand blood. If we're talking about dying, she'll be able to withstand something else as well. Uh-oh. Huh. You think your spears are stronger? I hate undying the undying in the game. No. She looks sick in this though. Playing battle against true? No. Ooh. Oh yes. Oh come on. Why is she so strong? You telling me? Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't want to restrict the power of Undyne, really. Ever. Why does it feel like she has determination? Because she does, because she's like the only monster that can really use determination correctly. Oh my goodness! Oh my Monsters can't have determination! They're screwed. This entire episode is just gonna be them fighting, is this? Stay behind me, Kumu. You'll die just like the others. Dang. Uh oh, she's gonna she's gonna use that raptophobia thing. Rest in peace, sorry. Wow, I love this series so much. Yes! About time somebody gets her. Gaster failed miserably, not trying to give anybody hate. Gotta give him hate, but. Oh. Mm-hmm. I love Undyne. My gosh. Wow, she blew the freaking Whoa! She wow. <gasps> she used she just used hate. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'm done. Good, good dodge. You're gonna have to try a little harder. Mm. Mm. Yes, I'm done. Yes, I'm done. Is that so? Mm hmm. That is totally so. Good skill. I'll give you that. Two? I love this battle against the True Hero Remix. Oh, 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 okay. Oh. Under no! <gasps> Come on. Stay determined, Undyne. You can get rid of me that easily. You better think again. Dang. Oh, ho, 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 you can. And you won't get past me. She's gonna be the one to kill her, hopefully. Oh. That hate, oh, that hate. Huh? I, I don't know what's happening. We have to leave. Yes, good win, Undyne. Good win. We have somebody that can finally beat the crap out of her. Oh, never mind. <gasps> she, no, she's not dying. Dang, she's fully healed and everything. Oh. Oh. oh my gosh. I think this series is going to kill off more people than Infinity War ever did. Oh, I forgot. The green kid died. His name's Cam or something. What? Robin? What are you doing here? Not Helping. Worse. Helping. Yes. Doing the right sorry. thing. Huh? Run. Run, 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 run. Don't let, don't, don't let what happened to, um, Cam. Oh, 
one. Oh, Toriel. Was that... Is that Azriel or Asgor? Yeah, that was yeah. awesome. This is Asgore. Yeah. Oh, that was just a warm-up scene. <sighs> now, uh... let me show you what true fire looks like. <laughs> oh gosh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> At least they put in some comedy in this. Mom! We were looking How could you bring our son to the school? How could you bring Frisk to the school? I came along to ensure safety. Oh, and you thought it was a good idea. Mm. Well, I... Mom! Dad! This is not the time for this! It's not the time for this mm. either. Frisk, there's Frisk. Frisk! Go to the refuge and don't move from there. Now. Okay. Frisk, I think we should go back and help anyone left out there. One dime beat Betty. That was like the MVP of this. Get back here this instant. I won't stay here to hear you both fight while Frisk and I can help someone out there. Yeah. Ugh, Frisk's right, Frisk? in some kind of mental state right now. Frisk, come on. There's no time to lose. There's no one left out there, Asriel. We were too late. Toria! Let, let's go back to Gaster's lab. But there can be more of these pink things! They all just retreated. I saw them running away from the school on my way here. The others around this area should be doing the same. Good. It's really good. Really good, actually, because now yeah, you guys got but time for you. We can still help here. Stay here, then. I'm leaving. I'm not your babysitter. Yeah, we don't. Don't be a jerk, Frisk. Don't be. Meanwhile, this house got destroyed as well. Wait, no, that's not- that's Why would you eat the entire thing, you idiot? Are you still struggling to get this crap out of y'all? I'm sorry for yelling. I know you just did what you had to do to get us out. Aku... This... this darkness... This horrible substance. We underestimated it so much. Yeah. I hardly feel like myself anymore. Our goals... Our very reason for existing seems to be slipping out of our grasp. Well, that's actually pretty good. Cool. I feel that this thing, this... This hate has its own plans. I don't know how long I'll be able to decline them. Oh no. Same thing's gonna happen to her, like what happened with Chara. How long until our friends from the school get here? There they are. Perfect. Now we wait for them to come. You're gonna beat him. I won't go and look for Frisk. I think we've done what we had to do to make them come for us. Even with determination on their side, in their current condition, Frisk stands no chance against us. <gasps> oh my and once goodness. I get rid of them. <laughs> Able to stop us. No, she's gonna eradicate Frisk. Who 
Ruth told her she could use my control panel. I told her she could use it. All training right now. Hey. Hmm. What is she even doing? She said she wanted to use her device from the AMD to message everyone in the city. Yeah, there's a lot of cameras. Attention everyone, this is an official emergency broadcast from the AMD to every human and monster in the city. For your safety, please remain indoors. If you must go outside, please do it in the company of a monster. A very dangerous being is hunting for human souls. If you encounter one of these pink things, leave the place immediately or ask a monster for help. Yeah. Their magic will scare them away. Do not be afraid. Monsters are always willing to help. Do not hesitate to ask for their assistance. Do not go outside until another broadcast is issued. Stay safe. Huh? What's going on? Oh no. Don't don't no 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 don't don't don't, don't go no. Are you hurt? I'm done. You look healed. Yeah. I am. It, it hurts. So much. Hey, you be It was my fault. Why does everybody blame each other? Gaster's good. Undyne did better. Sorry, Gaster, not being mean, but Gaster, not Gaster, Undyne. If she can transform into that again, let's rest it and actually make sure Betty doesn't retreat, they she'd win. She would win. Raptophobia clearly doesn't work against it, so yeah, lean on me. It's, it works. Go to that bedroom. I mean, it works, but, like, Undyne can just summon more spirits to counter it. Like, see how much she, sp like, summoned? Dr. Gaster, I believe I know how you feel. I'm, I'm so sorry. You understand how I feel? My grief. You played a big role in the deaths of those close to me. Yet you stand before me with the insolence, the audacity to apologize and claim you know how I feel. Human, if you weren't Frisk's friend, you'd be dead where you stand. Yo, he stands as that. There's Frisk. Where are Undyne, Alphys, and Papyrus? Undyne and Papyrus are in the bedroom. And Alphys? In another failing body bag caused by your friend here. I see. Frisk, are you... Come with me, Jessica. I'll give you something. Okay. Underground, W yeah. wind. I think this belongs to you. What is it? What did you get me? <gasps> She's not here. She was performing an hour ago. My sunshine, where are you? Please. Oh gosh. I'm sorry, I wasn't Holy here. Holy crap, me. man. I almost let out the waterworks. Oh. Thank you, Frisk. 
You're a very nice and kind child. No, I'm not. Can't afford to be. Not anymore. Not anymore. Nope. I thought the episode ended, I was like, are you kidding me? I was hey, Frisk. Hello, Azriel. May I go with Azriel to the backyard, Toriel? Um... Okay. Frisk, what's gotten into you? You haven't been acting like yourself lately. I've been lying to you, Azrael. What? This whole mess is my fault. How? It's no one's fault, Frisk. No one could have predicted what's been happening lately. <sighs> you don't understand! Oh no. I've been looking for a way to reset since we got to the surface. This is not supposed to be happening. But you promised you wouldn't reset! You even broke the button, didn't you? I lied about that promise. As for the button, that was probably my biggest mistake yet. Why do you think Sans was so angry with me? He knew I had been lying and pretending this entire time. But he probably didn't tell you. Duh, he knows everything. As for this whole mess, it probably won't end well. It's not supposed to. Unless I could go back. At that point, I had already done everything I could and tried every single route and variable. A couple times, each LV. He knew the timeline had been glitched. And I abused it. I wanted to see if I could get a different ending. So, after the first reset... Oh... Uh, hold on, before we continue, one little fun fact, if you do name your character Frisk in um, Undertale, it's like warning, this make well, this name will make your life heck. Proceed. And it's basically Undertale's hard mode. It's uh, it's like a hard mode of Undertale, but it ends after you fight Toriel. Man. See? It's basically the hard mode. I gave it a try. After all, worst case scenario, I just reset and try again. Carol was furious. Me. More so than usual. I'd been pushing the timeline to its limits with no consequences so far. No. I should have noticed there was something wrong with them. I mean, it was me who threw the hate for my genocide rotten on them. I thought it'd just go away. But they came back, blinded by this substance. Yep. In the end, everything worked out. I had the ending I was looking for. To be honest, I was ready to let it all go. I'd keep myself from resetting, go back to my black screen, and leave everyone on the surface. So you- What's wrong? That's just life though, Frisk. You gotta learn to 
had a little the bit world light. continued its course with me in it. I knew it was a matter of time until something bad happened. That's life. Either way, I could only continue. Like, it, it, I didn't it's... realize that when I got rid of the reset option, I couldn't save or load. That's life, Frisk. You gotta realize that. I wasn't allowed to interact with the timeline or modify it anymore. I can't reset this timeline. Nobody can. Nope. Then it happened. Do you understand, Asriel? Yeah. It'd be a miracle if I win this in one go. And if I lose, it's game over. Forever, too. Forever. Yeah. You don't have to worry about it. It's not like you can do anything anyways. I'm the only one who can defeat her. I'll go look for her and fight her. I'm not sure if I'll see you again, so... I just had to get this off my chest. I'm sorry I couldn't be the friend you wanted me to be. That is not true. You don't have to go now. We can wait. Maybe we can figure out another way. It's not gonna work. I already made up my mind. I'm going. And I'm going alone. First, you're making it great. The wait, the more people will die. You'll die if you go alone. You can barely hold your determination together. We can wait and get stronger first. Since when were you worried about me dying? It's not like you didn't try to do it yourself a couple times. He can feel again. Stop Stop being a... I might have been confused, Frisk. But you did everything of your own volition. You can still feel remorse and regret. You can feel love. You chose to ignore that and still almost killed the entire underground. He's right. If you go right now, you'll lose. At least Flowey wasn't such a coward. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Frisk, you were losing it, you all. What are you... Boy? There's another part. Oh, there's another part. There's another part. Alright, um. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Um. That was interesting. Wow. Wow. That was... Frisk, what are you doing? What are you getting yourself into? Why did you say that to Azrael? Why are you being a crap bag? Why? Part two being made. Well, alrighty, guys. I'm uh, that'll be all for um uh, this episode of Glitch Tale. I accidentally closed my um uh, the with uh, the YouTube um love part two will be coming out very very soon. I am um, uh I gotta react to it first. It's 40 minutes. I looked at the next part. It's 40 minutes. So, uh, 41 minutes, so, um, next time, bring your snacks, bring everything, because it's gonna be, like, a, I don't know, like a Stranger Things episode, and, um, uh, yeah, um, I will see you guys in the next episode, and bye, X up.